Are they turning frogs into villagers? They start out as regular frogs and then they get experimented on? Oh my god. Oh, demon summoning. Fantastic. Oh god. Ew, don't lay on it. Ew. <laughs> Do not visit these Animal Crossing islands. They are actually haunted. Now you may know by now that Animal Crossing has put out a new dreaming update. But the thing about dreams is that they can very easily turn into nightmares. Sorry if that was corny, it was too perfect to pass up. Also look, they're like ghosts. Ghost versions of villagers on my shirt. It was just, it was too perfect not to get. But yes, today I am going to be visiting haunted, creepypasta-esque Animal Crossing Island so you don't have to and shouldn't. So I came across this article of the scariest dream addresses for Animal Crossing. And this first one I've heard about before because it first started in Animal Crossing New Leaf. It's Ica Village. Perhaps the scariest of the group, and certainly the most well-known spooky island, is Ica Village. Which this version is a remastered version of the New Leaf one, which basically turned into its own Animal Crossing creepypasta. Yay. Love those. It features several bizarre areas and rooms that reportedly bear no connection to one another, but have sparking theories? I think they mean sparked. <laughs> There's so much to cover on this massive island with many fan theories out there. So those who are looking for some spooks should make sure to check it out. I'm looking for some spooks. All right, let's go check it out. Okay, as you can see, we are now in the dreaming realm. I want to dream. So of course we have to connect to the internet to dream. <laughs> this is how dreaming works. Okay, I might regret this, but it's for you guys. It appears to be for an island called, I, I guess that's it? <laughs> sure, please close your eyes and relax. I'm not relaxed, I'm not relaxed at all. Also, you may be wondering what I'm wearing. You'll see. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I'm scared. Okay, guys, we've made it. I see ducks back there, and I'm very confused already. So yes, this is my outfit. I tried to make the scariest outfit I could so I would fit in, and demons wouldn't try to steal my soul. They'd think I'm one of them. Smart, I know. So yes, this is me, Demon Lauren. Feel free to make fan art. Also, make sure to like this video. Regular Lauren's birthday was last month, but Demon Lauren's birthday is this month. Today, actually. So like this video for Demon Lauren. Also, to help me keep my soul. Just like you have to connect to the internet to dream, you have to digitally leave likes to save people's souls. It's, it's real, look it up. All right, everything seems okay so far. There's this dinosaur. Oh my God. Okay, okay, there's so much to unpack. Where's the dinosaur's head? Well, there it is. <laughs> okay, so it's just like a snake dinosaur. That's terrifying to think about. There's a bed with clocks around it and cannons and presents. Can I take the presents? What's in the presents? Can't get in there. This is torture. There's presents and I can't reach them. Is this a metaphor for like, we're running out of time before death? Oh my God. That's what it is. There's acorns. Hel hello? Help me. I don't like this music. There, oh God, there's shoes. Message, wait, what is happening? Okay, there's missed messages, balloons and shoes and a creepy baby doll. What does this mean? There's a random lady up here. Ren, oh no. Okay, hello? I can't reach you. Help, wait. Oh, there's a house. I'm scared. <laughs> Whose house is this? Oh, I don't like the music. What is? Oh God. I mean, well, this clutter is just giving me anxiety. Oh, they're all facing the wall. Everything's facing the wall. Oh, what's on the other wall? Do you see this? Creepy eyes? Well, I don't like this. I'm just gonna go. Demon Lauren out. Basement? It's probably gonna be a terrible choice. Okay, well, this is, this is cute, I think. Everybody's looking, okay, what? Oh God. Uh, cat picture here. Looks okay. Cat picture behind us. Creepy pasta. Okay, bye. Is this telling me a story? Is this the mom? And then and then the mom and, and a little girl and a dad and she had a dog. Okay, I'm gonna try and piece it together. All right, where do I go now? Oh, oh, I can take these. What are they? Nose drip. Nose drip. Are they, are they all nose drips? What is the meaning? Oh, God. Hello. Who are you? I, uh, okay. Oh, <gasps> you were in that picture. You were the little girl in that picture. Are you a ghost? I'm gonna go try and figure out more of the island. Ew, there's all like, 
What is this, fish? I don't know what this is, and skulls, and a weird noise, and computer parts. Ooh, I mean, this is kind of cute. House? The lights are all off in this house. Why are the lights all off? I'm scared. Oh God, um, hello, hello? Okay. Okay. The walls are creepy. I can't understand any of this island. Jeez, there is some obsession with frogs. Oh my god, wait. Are they turning frogs into villagers? <gasps> is this how frog villagers become villagers? They start out as regular frogs and then they get experimented on? Oh my god. We blew this conspiracy wide open. Okay. What's with the girl pictures on the ground? What is with anything happening? What is this? S-O-S. Somebody's trying to ask for help. So yeah, I did look up some of the theories about this and it revolves around, oh God. Is that supposed to be like her as a dead body with ants eating her? Ah! So yeah, the story is about this young girl who like her mother is never like happy with her or the way that she is she always wants like i could be perfect so then the story is apparently like about or at least the original island was about this oh god it's about this little girl's like descent into paying attention to all her imperfections because her mother always points them out and is never happy with her and then she decides to end her life but there's so much going on oh god is this the mother is this supposed to be the mother I think so. Apparently there's an order to the houses, but I am so freaking confused. <laughs> oh God. Okay. Yeah, I think this is the last house. Her eyes are gone. This is weird. Dinner tables, but the chairs are toilets. Great. This is weird. Oh, am I supposed to jump across? H Hello. Aika, I wish I could read what you're saying. Messy house. Um, oh my god, was she locked up in a cage? Is that what this is trying to say? Aiko is in a cage with an axe? So I think the first house we went into was supposed to be how she thought her life was. Like things were cute and nice and perfect. And then this is what it's actually like. Like the house was destroyed. She was kept in a cage. I don't know what this means. We're just analyzing the crap out of this island and have it make sense. Whoa, okay. And then in this room, she's scribbled out of the mom and dad picture. There's so much symbolism that I don't get. Oh God. Yeah, okay, so the first first house looked similar to this, but a lot nicer and not as creepy. Now we're in this house, which I think is like how things actually were and everything's scribbled out. I think this is her becoming like crazy because it's the doll with the ax and she started scribbling out her happy family. I think we kind of went out of order and the other house was her dead, I guess. Oh God, and there she is. Please don't hurt me. Okay, don't know who you are. Welcome. Well, thank you, creepy eyes. Help. Are we inside of her mind? She needs help. Okay, I think this is the last house. Is this like a memorial for her? I'm getting real like the ring vibes. We gotta get out of here. Oh my God. Demons. What are these things? Ugh. Nope, nope. Okay. This island has officially hurt my brain and I need to leave. Get away from me, ghost Ica lady. If anybody wants to shed some light in the comments about what I just experienced, you let me know. All right, so that last island, there's so many fan theories and story theories that are out there if you wanna go look. But yeah, it's basically about a little girl whose family becomes broken. Her mom has too high expectations of her and inevitably it ends with her demise. But yeah, you can find out more about that online. All right, so this next dream address, I'm a little nervous about because there's no photo. It's the only one with no photo. It's called Ghibli Sixth Station. The Sixth Station is a reference to a song featured in Studio Ghibli's Spirited Away. However, the island is not a reference to the beloved film, but rather is inspired by the Victorian era. A massive school can be viewed on the left side of the island where students have painted in blood and papers strewn across the ground spell out, watch out. Great. <laughs> but the upstairs room is perhaps the creepiest of all. Ooh. All right, I think this one might be in English. Yes, take me to the spooks. Oh, it's raining. What the heck is that flag? What is that flag? Okay, we're off to a great start. Yep, the papers say watch out. There's 
blood splatter on the ground, being dragged into the sewer system. Great. Oh my God. Hello. Hello, sir. No one. 1,724th station. Bye. Oh, there's a creepy skull. There's a creepy baby. Love creepy babies. Okay, so there's a house over here. Let's go there first. Okay. Demon summoning. Oh, it's nice. I'm scared. Oh, it's so dark. Oh, it's so dark. And there's just one wheelchair. Empty wheelchair. Is it for me? I'm gonna sit in it. Yes. Imagine this was your life. You're like, I just like sitting in super dark rooms in my chair, wiggling my toesies, just waiting for somebody to walk in so I can scare them. That's it? No other rooms? Oh wait, no, there's a basement. Always creepy stuff in the basement. Is there nothing? There's nothing. There's nothing in the basement. It's just pitch black. Get me out of here. Ah! You know when you like run up the stairs really quick when you're coming from the basement because you're afraid something's gonna like grab you? That's how I felt in the game right now. Oh God, it's just nothing this again. I hate it. I didn't even know you could make things this dark. What the heck? Okay, so that's just the wheelchair house. Fantastic. Now where else do I go? Oh, what's this say? I can hear someone below. <gasps> no! Who are you? Oh, God. Do you remember? No? Okay, bye. Oh, no, there's kid toys on that grave. Oh, there's all toys on the graves! I'm thoroughly creeped out. Of course Coco's here. Of course you're here, Coco. Let's follow the bloody footprints. Oh god, skeletons! What? This is amazing. We're going in. Ooh! Oh god. This is terrifying. Can I sit here? Yes! I am queen of the demons! Bow down to me. I mean, me just being here is making this like 10 times creepier. <laughs> okay, well, I guess we'll follow the blood trail. Oh, I can't. Okay, that, well, that's probably for the best. Is this where the experiments are done? I know they mentioned something about experiments. Okay, upstairs. Oh my god. Oh, I hate it. Oh my god. What happens if I walk on it? Ugh, I hate it! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> this has been one of the creepiest rooms, and it's so simple, yet so effective. Okay, let's get out of this house. The grudge girl lives here. Okay, so there's only two houses, but there's a whole left side of this island. So what's on the left side? Oh God. Oh, it's a school. Oh my God. Look at the face. Right there, in front of me. Face. Ah, Stitches, get out of here. What happened in this school? Oh, demon summoning, fantastic. Love demon summoning. And I think I got through the whole island. I really like this one. This one's very creepy, unsettling but in a more in-your-face way than, than the last one was. This next one, though, I have not heard that much about. I'm probably gonna butcher this name, but it's Hito Kui. We're just gonna call it Hito Village. Also known as Cannibal Island. It's also a recreation of a creepy island from New Leaf. But yeah, excited for Cannibal Island. Yay! <laughs> Who wouldn't be excited about Cannibal Island, right? <laughs> May your dream of Cannibal Island be a sweet one. Thanks. I don't even know where to start. I guess this first house? Oh, it's like a doctor's waiting room. With a security camera for some reason. Doctor. Hello, doctor. I have, oh God, another security camera. Doctor, doctor, where is you? Oh God. Oh God. Um. Doctor? <laughs> is this a jail cell? Oh god, I don't like this. <laughs> what is this? Bloody eyes on the wall. Get me out! Ah! Doctor! Please! Somebody! Okay, this looks normal. Okay, maybe it was just a bad dream. The other room was just my mind playing tricks on me. It's it's all fine. It's, maybe the doctor's downstairs. Oh god. Um <laughs> What? Oh god, ew, don't lay on it, ew! It's, it's fine, it's fine. They have all these hamsters, maybe this is from hams, hamsters? I don't, I don't know. Animal Crossing is supposed to be cute. This isn't cute. Everybody stay away from that doctor's office. Something's not right about it. Sausage. I love sausage. Oh god, oh no. Hello, 
Ma'am or sir, you look friendly. I never know what they're saying. I don't know. You seem friendly. It's fine. This is safe. Oh, it's ducks. You guys making duck sausage? Um... Well, this looks suspicious. <laughs> but I mean, who am I to question it? Oh, it's a bunch of... It's meat. It's fine, though. This is a sausage place. Let's go upstairs first. <laughs> upstairs is always better than downstairs, usually. Oh, it's fine. It's just meat smokers. This is fine. Oh, God. Is that a human body back there with the skin removed? No, it's fine. It's fine. Look, there's cheese in there. I love cheese. This is all totally fine. Nothing to see. Just a normal meat shop with ducks in the lobby. Is this where they feed all the things that don't get turned into meat? Well, at least they're recycling and using all the product. Oh. Hello, duck per- Oh my god, are they breeding with the ducks? Um, well that can't be good. <laughs> Gonna follow the train tracks. Oh god, don't go this way. Well this is pretty. Oh god, it's a graveyard! Let's go up here. Oh, what's- Oh, hello. Hello, ma'am. You really like death and, uh, black things, huh? That's cool. I like black as well. Um... What? Creepy wedding. This must be where they keep the groom to keep him from running away. Totally normal. Oh god. This is below the wedding chapel? <laughs> what happened? Was there some sort of wedding massacre? What's upstairs? I'm scared. Okay. Demon summoning. What a nice wedding venue. You know, if people are asking about wedding venues, I will make sure to recommend you guys. B bye. Be out of here. Okay, lady. I don't know what kind of business you're running in there, but I don't want any part of it. Be out of this graveyard. Okay, more graves. Has the lights out again, but we'll go in anyway. Okay, don't know what's going on in here. Oh, great. People that got decapitated. Goodbye. The picture on the wall. Why? Uh, getting out of here. Bloody handprints. My face! I fit in here. Yay! They're all over the wall. What is with the creepy people faces? I thought this was supposed to be Cannibal Island. Oh, God. There's a restaurant? Yeah, sure, let's check out the restaurant. What could they possibly be serving? I wonder. Oh wow, what a lovely restaurant. Check out the back room. Seems normal. Seems normal. Still seems very normal. <sighs> what about the basement though? Oh no. Is that a bride? Is that the bride from the wedding? Oh God. I'm starting to suspect that these people eat people. All right, I don't think I'm gonna eat here, but you guys enjoy. It's the mummy man. Did you escape from them? Get out of here. All right, and I'm back to the start. I think I, I think I explored all of Cannibal Island. All right, guys, well, that's some of the spookiest Animal Crossing islands that you can come across in the dream realm right now. There are more and lots of other themed ones. So if you want me to visit more creepy Animal Crossing islands, or just more Animal Crossing Islands in general, then make sure to leave a like before you go so that I know. Subscribe if you're new to the channel and hit the notification bell so I don't get lost in the void that is now YouTube. And as always, I will see you guys soon.